black, white, bold colors, glass, solid, baskets, no baskets. Today, I'm going to give you a few tips before you choose your next cabinet. cabinet is one of the most underutilized pieces of furniture in any room because it's the place where we get to either store our things or store and display those things. So my first tip is to decide exactly what you're trying to do. If you're trying to store something only, meaning extra papers that you probably actually could scan and get rid of, but that's just another tip for another day, uh, versus you really want to display your art collection or your book collection. Well, this is where you get to decide if a solid front or a glass front or a completely open front is best for you. Are you a duster? Are you gonna keep it clean? Are you gonna access this stuff from day to day? If you're not gonna access it, it's just gonna sit there forever and you're not gonna touch it until you move again, go with glass because it's gonna just collect dust. If you are a clean freak like me and you're gonna dust all the time and you're gonna take pride in moving things around, you know, from season to season, adding, subtracting from those spaces, go with open cabinetry, it'll be a beautiful look. Bookcases are awesome. Uh, but here's the tip with bookcases. They're not just for books. When you fill the entire bookcase, meaning every single shelf, it starts to look like an overwhelming wall of things that you have read, haven't read, it doesn't really matter, but you can't really actually digest what's on that shelf. If you break it up, meaning negative space, a few books here, a little knickknack, a few books here, a few books here, little plant. Then we start to appreciate what's in there and we are, our eye is drawn into the stuff on the bookcase. And don't forget guys, this is a great place to use color. If you really don't want to spend a whole lot of money investing in a really bright or bold piece of furniture that is linen or fabric, a cabinet can always be painted down the road. Thank you so much to The Brick for partnering with me on all of these videos. As always, these tips are for you, so please let us know at these accounts what you would like to hear next.